rematch. This time. In, in real, real life! life. <laughs> 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 Oh, the snow is melting. Yeah, I think the sun is back. Good morning, everybody, and welcome back to Tokyo. Morning. I think that is officially the end of our snowy part Phase. of the trip. Yes. There's like little clumps of snow still left, but it's all just melting now. But we have uh, some awesome activities planned today in Tokyo. But it's like 10.30 and I need some coffee. Okay, Japan. who remembers this song, by the way? Like the Japan tourism place. To sing and chat, take a look. Do the dance. <laughs> that turns into a beautiful evening and together make a beautiful life and if you We did a music video once because we you know we're cool like that and we use that song and it's here in Japan supposedly Coffee 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 Oh uh, we noticed that Japan opens up really late, like it's 10.30 and everyone is just slowly waking up, but they do stay up super late, especially at the sake bars. People just stay up so late there. When we went to one like two nights ago, I'm sure we were there way later than we should have been drinking way too much sake. Do you guys think we're in the tourist zone at the moment? Do you have a red Yeah, it's this one. Oh, Red bean. Thank you. So last time we were in Japan, I saw these red bean fishes everywhere. I didn't try the fish one, but... Steve loves red bean paste. It's nice, it's sweet. I'm not a fan. This is what they are. They're like hot Magic carp they are. <laughs> like from Pokemon. Mmm. <laughs> Still just as good. Still just as good? Yeah, I'm guessing you don't want to try any. No, I'm good. <laughs> <laughs> All right, don't judge us, guys, but the best coffee we've had in Japan... No, not the best coffee in Japan, but the best Starbucks in the world has been in Japan for some reason. So, uh, we're getting our coffee from here this morning. Thank you. Thank you. So, like, in Japan, absolutely refuse tips. And we weren't even, like, trying to tip them. It was just the coffees came to 799 yen and I gave her 800 yen. I was like, you literally, you just keep that one yen because that's just gonna make my wallet heavier. She's like, no, I can't, I cannot accept the tip. Even though it's the equivalent of like a cent. It was insane, but Starbucks does taste different in Japan, which is why we get Starbucks here. We usually don't, but it's actually not too bad. So last time we were in Tokyo, we didn't go to Mount Fuji and uh, we actually don't have time to go to Mount Fuji today. So we've come to the second best thing you can do, a free observation deck. And it is such a clear day today after all the snow that fingers crossed we should have a good view. It's the Bunkyo Civic Center. 25. This one. Wow, you actually get quite the view of Tokyo. So you got the tower just over there. Let's go find Mount Fuji. Oh wow, you actually see it with like the city. It's like quite a cool little angle. Probably zooming on. If you guys are looking for like a free way to see Mount Fuji, come here. Highly recommend you get quite a panoramic view of the city. Even if you just want a view of the city. Yeah. Like, look at this. And it's like not busy at all. Yeah, there's really just no one here. So nice. Of course, going to Mount Fuji. 
It's probably yeah. the best option. Yeah, that, that needs to be our next Third trip. return to Tokyo. You know yes. we're coming back to Japan. Oh, this next good. time, hopefully, cherry blossom seed. Alrighty, guys, so we're hungry. We want some lunch. So we've come to Tokyo Station because for some reason, Tokyo Station has some awesome restaurants here. And over the past few days, we've had way too much seafood. So we now want to find a vegetarian place. So I'm trying to find a place called Tea's, Ta Tea's Tantan. Yeah. Tea's Tantan is vegetarian vegan ramen. And the award for the most annoying <laughs> restaurant to find. That took us way too long. If you're coming to this video to find out how to get to Tea's Tantan, don't. Because it took us so long. It was like 20 minutes, but we're here. It took us like 20 minutes to find it. Yeah. We found it. It looks cute. There's a little line. See? Vegan ramen. Because if you are vegetarian or vegan, it can be super hard to find, you know, vegetarian ramen. This is one of the only few places, hence why it's so popular to come here. Well, especially vegan, because usually they add egg and stuff. Yeah. Or ramen's usually so much beef broth, or it's super, not, not very flavorsome. So I'm really, like, excited to let you guys know this is a good spot. So you can try between white sesame, black sesame, or gold sesame, and then you can choose if you want vegetables with it. So I think I'm going to go for the white sesame with vegetables, and the deep fried dumplings. So we've just been given our food. This looks actually looks really good and I always want these but they're usually filled with beef so I'm so glad I can get this. This is probably what I'm excited for the most. Is that Japanese Harry Potter? What? That was worth getting lost for. It was seriously the best ramen we've ever had. Do you reckon? Oh yeah. And those dumplings so good. as well. Uh where are these? Cute! No, do that again. Cute! No, don't say like they are cute! <laughs> <laughs> Just take a bite of the cute donut! <laughs> We're in Akihabara! Oh Is that what it's called? Akihabara? Akihabara? Electric Town! Cute! <laughs> Again for you. Press, press it. Okay, Cleo. This is for you. Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, that's looking pretty good. Yeah, I know no, that the legs. You, they could oil them up. That's the issue. Yes, yes, yes. wait. Yes, yes, yes. Curvy, curvy. I think that means you won my score. We found a Jess version. She's like crouching because it's so small. Focus. So the big one defeated us, so we're going for the mini curves. Yeah? Yeah. Do it, Bobby. Come on, mini curves. At least lift up. Uh, let's go now. Sega, you defeated us. We wasted too much money here. Guys, ever since I saw this on like a lad bible or uni lad page, I've always wanted to do it. We're going real life a Mario Karting right now. <laughs> so when you come in, they have all these outfits that you can choose from. But, I mean, why be Spider-Man when you can actually dress up in the outfits? You're missing something. I'm missing something? Okay, now we're ready. There we go. Look at me, Mario! Perfect.
So these are our carts. They're fully automatic cars and they take fuel in the back here. Yeah, this looks awesome. Everyone's lining up. Luigi's jumping in. I'm a Wario. I'm a gonna win. This is honestly the most insane and coolest experience you can do in Tokyo. We're literally driving on the streets going like 50 kilometers an hour and uh, it's so much fun. The sun is just setting and it's so good. How cool is that? It's the Tokyo Tower just there. Oh, we had a car breakdown. <laughs> So we've made a little pit stop. We're halfway through the trip, by I the way. I officially lost my moustache, by the way. And I also <laughs> thought I'd lost my passport for a second, but it's all good. But just to add, oh my goodness, look what's in front of us at the moment. What? <gasps> look how huge this thing is. That's like as tall as that building just behind no, us. Transformers is real. <laughs> Everyone just cried a little bit. It's not a Transformer. Oh, what is it? It's a Gundam. Alrighty guys, we just got to our accommodation for the night. Now, it's something different that we haven't done when in Japan. We've done the hotels, we've done the capsule hotels, but now we wanted to live like the locals because it was super interesting how like local Tokyo people live. So we've booked an Airbnb for the next couple of nights and it's pretty insane how small these places are. And I'm sure this is a very standard like house for a local Tokyo resident. So as we walk in, this is the kitchen. Like that is it. I think that's a little fridge maybe. Yeah, that's the fridge just there. We got the bathroom here, which is the toilet and tiny. Wow, that is so small. It kind small. of reminds me of a cruise bathroom because you know how you have to step up into yeah. a cruise bathroom? Like it's tiny. Yeah, and then this that's it. Oh, there is a uh, another fridge and microwave as well. But this is the entire studio apartment. And I think for two nights it costs us 60 bucks Australian. Yeah. So it's like 50 US. But yeah, we're staying here for the next two nights. But Mari Kart, guys. We need to chat about Mari, Mari Kart. Kart. That was seriously one of the best experiences, not just in Japan, not just in Tokyo, but one of the best experiences we have hands down ever done. See, when Steven told me that we're doing Mari Kart, I thought we were going to be going down like alleyways and stuff on the go-karts. We were going on like full-on freeways and stuff like that. It was insane. And we were too, it was like, I don't know, for two hours. I was like, whoa, that is so cool. And there's this one part we went, what was it called? Rainbow Bridge? Rainbow Bridge. I remember Rainbow Bridge. And I was like, this actually feels like I'm in Mario Kart. And later I told Steven that, and he goes, yeah, because they based one of the levels in Mario Kart, the rainbow level, on this on this bridge. It was insane. insane. Like we were going 60, 70 kilometers an hour on these carts because we were on the roads. We were on the freeways, we were on the highways, there were trucks cutting us off. It was so off. cool. Like literally, there's if you so come many to Tokyo, people that I think would love this. Like if you're coming to Tokyo, you have to do it. Like it's the best thing I've it's done. It's the best review we it can was, give. Amazing. Anyway. But if you are new around here and you've made it this far, make sure you hit that subscribe button. And if you are subscribed, give us a thumbs up and leave a comment below with one day left in Tokyo. And when we came here, we went to a place and every single comment was, why did you go to this version instead of the other version? So try guess where we're going. In try guess below. in the comments <laughs> below. It's somewhere super fun. Anyway. Good See night. you guys. A little boxes on the hillside. A little boxes made ticky tacky. Little boxes.